The Malama Hawai'i leg of the worldwide voyage is coming full circle after a successful voyage to Kauai, Ni'iho, and Nihoa. Hokulea and Hikianalia have now visited each of the eight major Hawaiian islands and returned to Oahu's leeward coast where Makua Valley greeted them. It was real special that the first stop on Oahu would be here. And this is a traditional stopping place. And we know that there's connection between here and Kauai. We know that. In its more recent history, the U.S. military has used Makua as a live fire training site since 1943. My name is Joe Lee. I work for the Army. I just want to welcome all of you to Makua Valley. Uh, we respect everything that you do and your way of thinking. We just want to let you know that the Army is in support of you, and that's why we're here. Uh, the valley itself has been used for military training. So throughout this entire valley, um, there's remnants, unexploded, uh, residue here and there. Our army must protect us. They can no longer destroy our aina in the name of protection. Dr. Fred Dodge and son Vincent of Malamamakua have gone through the long process of litigation with the U.S. military to allow public access to Makua Valley for community groups such as the Ohanava'a. We got inside the gate by Sumi And I just want to share that with you, just, just that brief piece because if you just came today, you go, wow, look at how well everybody gets along. We've worked hard to do that. The determination of Malama Makua and other community groups to preserve cultural Hawaiian sites caused the military to temporarily halt the munitions abuse on the land. In those same efforts, the mission of the worldwide voyage is one of peace and restoration, mending the hurt that humankind has inflicted on Mother Earth. Coming here you know, to Makua is, provides a unique opportunity to see what's happening to our aina uh, up close and personal and what's um, currently happening with the military and how they're using the land. For a majority of the patrons, this was the first time they were able to witness the storied valley for themselves. The most important thing for healing in any process, I think, is just a change of mindset. So coming here, allowing community groups to come here and see an ikemaka and experience Makua Valley for itself uh, puts people into this mindset of what's happening with our aina and uh, what can we do in the future to protect it. With this rare access, Malama Makua members hope that the Va'a Ohana takes the lessons of this sacred place with them on their journeys to distant shores. It really was our greatest pleasure and honor to cultivate the connection between the canoes and Makua, the restoration you know, of Aina culture and all the practices that come together. For more information on Hokulea and her worldwide voyage, visit hokulea.org.